Hello everyone, I'm back again. In this video, I will show you how to recover deleted files from a hard drive, from an SSD, from a USB stick, or from any type of external drive. So simply, I will connect my USB drive. All right, it shows up here. Simply, I go to this folder. Somehow, there are some files here, like images, documents, I mean, any type of document file, like PDF, Word, or whatsoever. Audio files. Video files. And there are some couple of files here. Now, what I'm going to do is, somehow, I accidentally delete all the files. All right. Now this drive is completely empty, means still you can't be able to restore deleted files from the recycle bin. That's a bit difficult, right? But don't worry, let me introduce Minitool Power Data Recovery Software. With the help of this tool, you can be able to recover your deleted data easily. Links provided in description, you can recover permanently deleted files from hard disks, SSDs, or USB drives, like images, important documents, videos, or whatsoever in any file formats that you can recover. It can support all types of devices, like if you are using PC or laptop, USB drive, external drive, or you can even recover data from SD cards as well. As mentioned, it supports all kinds of file types. All right, now simply click on download now. Install the setup. Click on install now. There is a warning pop-up. Select yes. After everything's get done, the interface looks like this. Here, we have all logical drivers connected to system and the devices. So this is the USB drive, which we accidentally deleted files in the beginning, right? So simply select scan. The scan process usually takes more time to recover. You need bit patience. Here you can recover data by path of the drive. It shows up all the raw data files here, or you can even recover data by file type. It takes a lot of time, depends on previous files you have deleted on same by various level of partition addresses. I'll fast forward this process. All right, and there we go. It scanned a lot of files, like more than 2000 files. For some users, you may get even more. Here you can recover previously used folders. Data, bit complicated. Everything is mentioned by date. Or if you are confused, you can try to recover file by file type. So select the files you want to recover. Like here, I'll want to recover documents, pictures, videos. You can even preview them. All right, now simply click on save, set path manually. Create a folder in the path you want to recover files. Select folder, now okay. All right, so files got successfully recovered. Let's go to the recovered path. As you can see, each file gets recovered by its file type. Let's check out a document file. There we go, it's perfectly got recovered. Same, let's open another one. All right, it's fine. Let's check out pictures. It's recovered well, even without errors. Same for all other files. And videos too, as well, like no issues. Everything's got perfectly recovered well. And there's some other options, like you can recover files from specific location on system, like desktop, recycle bin, or you can custom select the folder to recover files. So right now for this free version, you can actually recover data up to one gigs. If you want to recover more files you need to register, check out these plans too. They offer a lot of powerful recovery features and tools like Power Data Recovery Bootable and Video Repair Tool. There are a lot of file system types supported by this software. So that's all for this video, guys. Hope you liked. Also, check out the links below. Thanks for watching.